Hey, Raleigh, thanks for coming over today. Thanks for inviting me, Poppy and Branch. I'm always up for a fun day. You know how puppies are. We love fun. Well, we're glad that you love fun, because today we found something super fun. Oh, what is it? What is it? Raleigh, Branch and I found a whole bunch of rainbow gumballs. Whoa, rainbow gumballs? And in a baby bottle? That's the best! I know, they look so tasty. Raleigh, what's your favorite color of gumball? Oh, I like so many colors, but I think I really like a purple gumball. Well, here you go, Raleigh. Here's a purple gumball. Oh, thank you, Branch! Well, but wait, I don't want to be the first one to eat a gumball. Poppy, you should eat the gumball first. Here you go, Poppy. You should eat the gumball. Thanks, Raleigh. Nom, 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 nom. Poppy, how was that purple gumball? Was it super tasty? Oh, it was good, but... Whoa! Poppy! That gumball just turned you into a giant plush toy! That's crazy! Are you feeling okay, Poppy? Oh, I feel just fine. I'm just extra soft and squishy. Oh, and I'm back. Whoa, that was really cool! Branch, you should eat the next magical gumball! Okay, I'll eat the next magical gumball. Branch, what color of gumball are you going to have? Well, I like a lot of colors of gumballs, but... Branch, you should eat the gumball that's the same color as your hair. Raleigh, I think you're right. Maybe I should have a blue gumball. That gumball looks really tasty. I think it will be, Raleigh. Nom, 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 nom. How was the gumball? How was the gumball? Oh, it was really good. Whoa, Branch! You're all big and fluffy. Branch, you just turned into a plush toy. I know. It feels kind of cool to be a plush toy. Wow, Branch, you look so soft and fluffy. Maybe I can chew on you for a little bit. Now, Raleigh, I know that you're a puppy, but you can't chew on Branch. Oh, okay. I won't chew on Branch. And I'm back. Branch, you're okay. Of course I'm okay. And I'm especially glad that Raleigh didn't chew on me. Raleigh, it's your turn to eat a magical rainbow gumball. What color do you want? Well, I like all the colors, but I especially like a green gumball. Can I have a green gumball, please? Of course you can have a green gumball. The only problem with the green gumballs is that those are Maleficent's favorites, and sometimes she puts a curse on them and makes whoever eats them feel icky. Are you sure you want to take that risk, Raleigh? Well... I suppose I could eat a different one. I really like green gumballs. Okay, Raleigh. Oh, it's a green gumball. It looks so tasty. Nom, 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 nom. Oh, that was so good. Did I hear that someone ate my green gumball? I ate your green gumball. It was super tasty. Maleficent, what did you do to the green gumballs? Well, all I can say is that Raleigh may not be feeling well very soon. What? What do you mean? What's going to happen to my tummy? Raleigh, you ate the green gumball, and as a result, you will have brain belly. <laughs> but Branch, I don't want brain belly. All I did was want a green gumball. Oh, my tummy's starting to hurt. Wow, Maleficent is so mean. But Raleigh, don't you worry. I am one of the leading expert surgeons on the brain belly. And I will get you all fixed up. Raleigh, go ahead and lie down and I'll get you ready for your brain belly surgery. Okay, Poppy. Thanks so much. My tummy is starting to feel bad. Hey, you two friends. It looks like Raleigh isn't feeling well because Maleficent is a mean person. If you hope that Raleigh is going to feel better, make sure to tell him something nice in the comments below. And of course, make sure to give him some love by giving him a big thumbs up. Now, let's go and get Raleigh all fixed up. Okay, you two friends, Poppy here. Right here is the brain belly of Raleigh. Oh, poor Raleigh. He's not feeling well. Okay, the first thing we're going to do, we're going to give him a little medicine that he feels a little bit better. Okay, there we go. Raleigh's not gonna be feeling anything, okay? And remember, whenever we do a brain belly operation, 
We need a really sharp scalpel. Okay, let's start here. Now remember, precision cuts in this brain belly. Let's see who we have. Let's see what's making him feel bad. Looks like we already have some stuff. I wonder what it is. Oh, look at this. Okay, let's take this one out. Look who we have here. It's yellow, it's flexible. It looks like a candlestick and it's a keychain. Is this the candlestick from Beauty and the Beast? Oh my goodness, I think it is. This poor candlestick was stuck in Raleigh's brain belly. Okay, if you remember the name of this candlestick from Beauty and the Beast, write it down below in the comments. This poor guy was stuck in a brain belly. Okay, let's see who else is stuck in this brain belly. Oh, there's something green over here off to the side. What is that? You see this? Do you see this right here? Let's let's pull it out. Let's pull it out. What is this? Oh my goodness sakes. Poor Raleigh, he had a little alligator stuck in his brain belly. Poor guy. He looks so tough and he's super green. And he was stuck in a brain belly. Let's get him out of there. Okay, let's see what else is in this brain belly. Uh-oh, here's something. I wonder what it is. Look at this, look at this right here. I think we have something, let's pull it out. It looks like another keychain. Oh, look at that. It is a keychain, but this is a rainbow unicorn. How can you tell it's a rainbow unicorn? Well, because its hair is red, purple, blue, green, yellow, all the colors of the rainbow. And if you look at the top, it's got a little unicorn horn and a keychain. It's a rainbow unicorn keychain. Okay, let's keep on digging into this brain belly. Let's see what we have in here. Oh, it looks like we have something green. Oh, I wonder what it is. Let's pull it out. Oh, look at this. YouTube friends, this is the question of the day. This little character is a keychain. He's green. He looks like maybe a dinosaur. And he looks a little bit sad. If you know who this is, let us know in the comments below. Do you know the answer to the question of the day? Okay, now while you're writing your answer to the question of the day down below, we're going to keep fixing Raleigh. Remember, precision cuts whenever you do a brain belly operation. Oh, look at this. Look at this. Let's pull it out really slow, really slow. Oh my goodness. YouTube friends, I think we found Syndrome. Syndrome is the villain from The Incredibles. He's a little boy who is really good at technology, but he's just evil and he was stuck in a brain belt. And he is a keychain. Okay, let's see what else we have here. Now we gotta be very careful. It looks like we have something red right here. Oh my goodness. YouTube friends, look what we found. Red hair, a fish tail? This can only be one person. We found Ariel. And Ariel is on a keychain. What a cool keychain. Okay, let's keep digging. I think that this is something. I wonder what it is. Let's pull it out. Oh my. Okay, so this little figure is green. She looks, I don't know, possibly disgusted, maybe? She's folding her hands like she doesn't like what she's seeing. She's got a little bit of purple here. Now, if I were to guess, I would say that this is a character from the movie Inside Out. Now, if you agree with me, let me know in the comments below who you think this is. Once again, a character from Inside Out. You let me know who this green little disgusted character is in the comments down below. 
Okay, let's see if there's anything else in this brain belly. Gotta make sure you're thorough whenever you do a brain belly operation. Well, it looks like we got everything out of Raleigh's brain belly. The poor puppy, he wasn't feeling good. Let's go wake him up and see if he's feeling any better. Hey Raleigh, I just got done with your brain belly operation. If you hold on just a second, I'm gonna listen to your heart with my pet stethoscope to make sure that everything's okay. Okay, Poppy. Thanks for fixing me. Sounds okay. Sounds okay. Raleigh, I have good news. I think that you're gonna be okay. Oh, good. I was so worried. My tummy didn't feel good at all. Maleficent is such a mean person. She is mean, but I'm glad that you're feeling better. Thanks, Poppy. Thanks for fixing me. Well, YouTube friends, we're all so glad that Raleigh is feeling better after Maleficent was so mean. Now, if you're happy that Raleigh's feeling better, make sure to take a second and give him a big thumbs up. And then, of course, if you haven't yet, make sure you subscribe to Tons of Toys. And now, before you go, make sure to click on that little bell button up in the top corner to make sure that you don't miss out on anything new that happens on Tons of Toys. Have a great day. Bye-bye.